Hi, it's Terry Stevenson of the Builderall team, and in this video, we're going to learn how to add authorship to your blogs in Cheetah. I'm here on my Builderall Gwandama site overview page. If I look to the left hand side, we see our menu there. I'm going to choose blog. Here on this training blog, let's go into the training blog. And this gives you an overview of this blog. Access the authors. We're going to come over to the left hand menu to the authors tab. And let's click there. It brings up all of the authors I have on the site. But let's add a new author. So we'll click here, this blue button up in the right hand top corner. Now we can add an author and create an author. Let's open it up, the about, and put in the author name. I'm going to put in an email. Here's where you will write a biography. And pay attention to the biography. Make sure you're using the right keywords for your biography. It'll really help your SEO value. We'll just say we have our biography in there. That fills out the About section. Now let's choose an avatar. You can change the avatar. Right now it's a Builderall avatar. So we can click the button to change the avatar. And this will open up our digital file repository and we can select an image to upload here or choose from any of the images that we've already uploaded. Let's just say this is our author and we'll select it. That's how easy that is. Now on the social media, let's open up that tab and here is where you're going to add all of the URLs, the full URLs for your social media accounts. This also affects the SEO value of your pages. So any of your active accounts that you're cross-posting on or you're building and bringing your following to, make certain you enter the entire URL here. So I've copied my account there. I paste it in here. And I do the same for all of the accounts that I want listed. And then we're going to make certain we save and now we've created an author so we now have another author let's add a new post so if we click on new post on the right hand side we have the options on this menu set our authors we can add new authors in here as well let's just bring up our previously used lulu learner author so that's where you add your authors on the blog posts themselves. Now let's see how we can add a new author when we're just creating a post. This is a post page. I haven't gotten anything written on the post. Here on the right hand side we have our settings and menu for the title of the post. Let's just grab a title. And of course you put your thumbnail in here, choose your categories. But down here in authors, if we open that tab up, we can create or select the post author. So when you click there, it'll show you the authors that you have. But let's say I have an entirely new author. I haven't added the author at all yet. I haven't created the profile, but I just want to add this author right now. So let's say we have a new author by the name of Super Mario. Click that and we have created our author. So let's open it up and there's our new author that we were able to create even on the fly right when you're adding your posts right here in the right hand menu. Of course, you'll always want to save or that change will not take a effect. And then of course you would hit save once you've completed your post. I've brought you back to the blog overview page again because I want to, let's go back and take a look at our authors now. So we're going to come to the left hand menu choose the authors tab and you can see we now have three authors we have super mario we have our terry stevenson and lulu learner of course if we want to edit any of these 
we can. Let's go ahead and edit this Terry Stevenson authorship. And I'm going to choose the three dots on the author, choose update. Now here I can change the avid, I can do any of the editing I need to do. So let's go ahead and change the avatar. Select it once I've chosen it. And there's my new avatar. And I can make any of those other changes. And then, of course, hit save. And we have updated the author information. That's how easy that is. You can also delete an author very easily just by clicking on Super Mario here. Let's just go ahead and delete this author. Choose the delete. Yes, I want to delete it. Once it's gone, it's gone though. But we can delete that. And now that author has been deleted. So I hope that helps you understand how to add and edit and delete authors from your blog in Cheetah. And I'll see you in another training video.